people still, like even on the news, people still look at MMA and they go, oh, cage fighting. I oh, don't know about yeah. that. Like still. it's Yeah, it's ridiculous. Like it's just like any other combat sport. It just, Absolutely. Yeah, it's just, don't know, you know. They just, they just, but they're coming around. They are coming around. We've, we've definitely MMA as a sport. It's definitely moved into a mainstream light, mm. like especially in Australia. Australia was slow as well, so mm. it definitely has moved into that mainstream sort of sports genre now. Mm. And I think that's you know thanks to, you know, the outspoken ones, and uh, and then McGregor's probably one of those people that have helped uh, bring it in. Did you see the uh, footage allegedly of Conor McGregor punching an old man in the face? No. Okay. Well. Check that out. It's very, <laughs> very interesting. He's in a bar, allegedly, and there's just an old dude there and they're arguing and there's just a big a big left hand straight into the side of his head. There's old, just Conor McGregor punching this old dude. Why? Don't know. It came out last week. We'll play it now in the, in the podcast, but <laughs> I'll send it to you later. It's it's very, very strange. It sounds ter- terrible. It, I don't even know if it's like, because nothing's really come out of it legally. Yeah. So I don't know if it's like a marketing campaign yeah. or, or what. Yeah. It's, it's maybe, maybe Prophet 12 is really trying to push the boundaries. No. What are no. your thoughts on people like him? Um, I think before he started doing like crazy stuff, like throwing that trolley Buses in the and bus that. and then, and all that other stuff, it's just... <laughs> There, there, there's hyping up the fight and then there's just personally trying to hurt people, like trying to take digs at people, like in jeopardizing people's careers, livelihood. Throwing that trolley in the bus was ridiculous. Mm. Like glass went everywhere. What if like you got glass in your eye and you went blind? Yeah, like, well, um, his, oh, mate did. Um, what's his name? Yeah, he got glass in the eye, but thankfully he didn't go blind. Yeah. You know, but like, but it, imagine like someone actually got blind, blind. Like, sorry, he's not going to... Fix anything. Their life is you know, ruined because you've made a split decision to be. Yeah, to hype up the fight, to hype up the, to make yourself look cool. Like, like you just, that's, yeah. that's not a game. We're not yeah. playing. Like, I'm not part of your joke. I'm not part of your hype. Like, so the Aldo thing was great when he grabbed the belt in the middle of Ireland. You know, it's disrespectful, it's mean, but it hypes the fight. Yeah, everyone no one, makes no a lot one of money. gets hurt. But throwing a dolly through a bus, no. Nah. Come on, dude. That's too much. Of course, it's too much. But, too much. And then the UFC uses it as hype footage. But anyway, that's that's a whole other thing. <laughs> we won't talk about that. 